Hello everyone, welcome to back my channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before starting the video, please go ahead and hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. In the midst of his alienation from his sons Zach and Jeremy, Little People's Matt Roloff expresses deep parental sorrow. After the Roloff patriarch rejected their offer to buy the family farm and chose to sell a section of the property, instead Matt, 61, and his twin sons had a falling out. The Little People, big world actor made a confessional Instagram post during the holidays in which he talked about his regrets as a dad. The lengthy caption on the social media post by the TV celebrity covered a number of topics. We decided at the last minute to leave Oregon a day early so as to miss the huge ice storm. Matt said to go with a picture of the sky taken from an airplane. The 61-year-old went on to say, I'm so pleased we did, she continued, before pointing out that nearly everywhere except down here in beautiful Arizona was and still is chilling cold. The farm was entirely covered in ice within a few hours of takeoff, the TLC star stated. I wished everyone in the nation and the rest of the world continued safety, health, and warmth. After that, Matt talked about spending time in Arizona with his 55-year-old girlfriend, Karen Chandler, their parents, and the couple's acquaintances. It's my mother's first significant holiday without my dad, the reality TV star revealed, before adding, we had dinner together last night, and I'm delighted to report my beautiful mother is doing amazing. Additional images of Zach, 32, opening Christmas presents with his children Jackson and Lila, Matt, and a family picture including Matt, Karen, Jacob Roloff, his wife Isabel, and their son Matteo, as well as Radley, the son of Jeremy. In order to respect Matteo's parents' request for their son to remain anonymous, his face was obscured in the photo. A reader commented on the page, beautiful images that you have entirely displayed your grandson's face. Calling attention to it, it's not difficult to see how he appears, and his parents do not want his face to be revealed. They continued. Finally seeing Matteo was another person's comment, which prompted Matt to ask, which picture are you referring about? One respondent clarified, he has two different grandsons, therefore it's okay. Jacob respected his kid and covered his face because he didn't want his face to be seen. Jeremy displays his son's face, so his face was not covered. The author continued. One more fan chimed. That's Radley, Jeremy and Audrey's baby you see. Another person asked, why are they covering the baby's face is something wrong? Matt quickly stepped in, replying, Absolutely not. He's the cutest baby you've ever seen. They just believe in protecting his privacy until he's old enough to make his own choices. I respect that and wish I would have thought about that. Matt recently gave a head-turning update on the current status of his relationship with his son, Zach. In an interview with ET Online, Matt opened up about his rocky relationship with Zach and said it's on the right path. The status of the relationship, if I had to summarize it, I would say it's on the right path, the LPBW star explained. I'm talking to Zach every day, it's not easy, but it's going in the right direction I would say, and we don't have big expectations. Confirming that he hasn't sold the farm, Matt said, Plan B is actually taking place right now. All of the families that looked at the farm but couldn't get their heads around the long-term commitment of purchasing it are now gonna be able to stay here as a short-term rental, so I think earned. We're gonna set the farm up for more people to share it for a week or less than a week, so we're very excited about that. The TLC star, 61, said that his children were all on board with the idea, but he also understands that they have their own lives with their own properties to take care of. I think the kids are to the point, you know, especially Zach and Tori, where they move, they got their own project, they got their own space, he explained. I don't know that they're really worried about what's happening back here. We're hoping that another season doesn't go by where there's still strife, Matt's girlfriend Karen added. 